that new survival world smell. Hi, chicken. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to a new hardcore survival series with me, DS9 Fireblade. In this series, I will be uh, just seeing how long I can survive. Um, I do not as of yet have a goal, maybe at a later date we will go and set one, either it be defeat all the in-game bosses, uh, get an elytra, do the how did we get here advancement, or something along the lines, um, but for now it is just going to be a how many days can we survive in Minecraft. So current moment in time I will be doing probably about 20 minutes or so each episode and we will go and see how long that equates to and how many Minecraft days it goes and passes. So go and put your guesses in the comments section below and uh, obviously as you can see I'm already getting started. Uh, we'll just see how far we can go and get with this. So obviously I am not just going to be doing a survival series with no rules. Um, if anyone has ever seen Impulse, SV and Skizzleman's um, Naked and Scared series, um, it's going to be very very similar to that. Um, um, like very along those lines. So it will be no crafting armour. No. Wow, they make a very weird noise. Um, be no crafting armor. It will be no crafting potion, uh, brewing potions. No crafting gold apples or anything like that. And also to make things a bit more interesting and a bit more difficult, we're playing in the latest release, 1.14.3 on Java edition so we will have pillagers, illagers and uh, patrols to be dealing with as well Ow. and apparently bushes as well there's half a heart I'm never getting back So obviously at the moment I'm just trying to scout around for some sheep. Um, oh, and a, another rule which I have forgotten is no sleeping the night away. So I can lay in a bed to um, prevent phantoms from spawning, whereas I cannot go and sleep the whole night through. So obviously it just makes life a bit more difficult for us. Get out. If anyone can go and uh, tell me what that is actually from, somebody went and said it to me the one time and I have no idea what that is. Can I eat sweet berries? I can, but I also plant them as well for some reason. Finally, some more food. Not the sugar cane, that is. Crit. Hit him. Thank you. Thank you for your bacon. Right, where's. Bacon, come here. Thank you. Okay, so we have now a little bit of food. I say that we start going down. Uh, 
Uh, I can't actually see. Oh, there's a sheep there. and get you as well. Was there any more sheep around? So, okay, so from... Uh, something's up there. That's okay. So from what I'm already uh, gaining here, the one issue I know that I'm going to be having is food, because I keep sprinting, um, and obviously with a diminished supply of food, that's not going to work out well. So obviously, as I say, this is a, a definite learn as I go. There are no more that I can see. How much wool did I get? Just a single one. That's my sword being thrown on the floor. Let's not do that again. Okay. So I think here is a good place to start. We'll start digging down. definitely need to start finding now is some coal, some iron for swords and tools. Um, so yeah, coal is going to be a big one. I think we'll go and actually maybe stick on the surface for that. So we need to go and definitely find some surface caves with coal accessible and sheep. And I found a swamp instead. Don't go run into a witch hut. A witch is the last thing I would definitely want to run into. So obviously, um, as a part of this series, hopefully people will go and get involved. Um, please leave down in the comment section below what you think would be a good starting goal for this series and obviously if we have good feedback and if this series works out well I will obviously continue to do it um, so just let me know what you guys think there's a turtle there turtle's no good does not supply food okay there's a Looks like a surface cave. Where's the sun? The sun's going down. That's the most pathetic cave I've ever seen. That's not a cave. Uh, and two donkeys. That's an exceedingly scary noise. That was not a pleasant noise in the slightest. And now we have the night time, which is full of terror and sadness. Ah, 
Aha, sheep. Okay, so now we can go and make a bed. I need to actually make some wood first. Play this game. So, unfortunately, now I'm quite concerned that it's going to get rather dark and it's not going to pick up on my recording software. That there appeared to have been a hole. Ah! Ah, oh, no. Well, that lasted long. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you my survival series. Uh, you can't actually see me either. Yeah, I'm just a floating head. Um, let me just go and see if I can go and uh, set the time to... Uh, day. Yeah, so there we go. You can just see my very poor floating head there. Unfortunately, that is the start and end of my first episode on my survival series. Um, yeah, I didn't think I could do very well and that just proved it. Um, so, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for tuning in to this episode. Um, obviously, I will be back and next time we will go and have a challenge and hopefully you guys can go and help out along with it so thank you very much for watching and i'll see you all in the next episode <laughs>